comes. Sanbonani, do me long up Shenny, and welcome to yet another exciting episode of Teenagers on a Mission, right in SABC One Mzansi for sure. Trust me, this is the place to be at this particular point in time. Siago Miguel. Yeah, boy, yes, bakenge. Chengo mabesi choke. If it's not broken, do not fix it. Which is why we're going to be visiting an old episode of ours where we're going to learn something new and interesting. Absolutely right. I'm going to give you a few things. I'm going to give you a few things about the food better through e-recycling. Yep, yes. And I'm going to give you a few things. Litter is a very big problem with our landfills filling up at such a high rate. I'm going to give you a few things that we recycle as much as we waste. Absolutely, man. This is a jam-packed show just for you. So sit back, relax. And let's see what we have on the show today. Roko pana le kester no obamitsa ngore ke shala titi fo o tswang ko dimponyana tsa lapeng. O tlo ruta na hore ho bona ing recycling ile bo tlhokwa ho le. Kester na e tlo gona ruta hore ha ntente a recycling shop shop ke eng e bile e sebetsa jwana. Le bona na hore science e ruta jwa hore recycling ha ntente ke eng. Recycling shop shop yona ha ntente e tswa kae. Ho tswa e tla dilekate 1960s e bile e tswa ko the United States of America. Ribona na horu bukamo soba recycling bo ya kae kala bakala technology e leng teng ka jekule. O se lebala hore go testa hore o tseba ha ka kang hare ba pala the TOMT pits. All right, in Zanti Nako, if it's clear for you and I to conversate on social media, I'm talking about Facebook and Funugwazi. How do you recycle? Let's see what you guys had to say on Twitter. What can I just put it? OJ underscore 01 in a Utige. I categorize my waste. Mm, very nice. So basically, Opensela, when I offer, when I'm a classy or plastic or organic waste, very nice. Your bone of Angawako. West Billigas put it on non tan tam keys. Yenage Uti, I reuse water bottles. Mm, nice one. To keep those comments coming in on social media on Facebook, we are simply Tom's on Twitter at Tom's underscore SABC underscore one. It's Colin Sabatini. Let's go, Tom. All right, take a faith. We've heard what you guys had to say on social media right about now. Slana is calling all the way in KZN, Sibuta Secondary School to find out from these guys with Bona Bakabangan. So, when is it, Swami? Bani Kamalako? Who has a dog? I don't just got a recycling. Where is it? On Kazilega Bansich. I'm a paper, I'm a tea now, plastic. He's in door was the old seven zisa foods. We never do seven zisa. Is it a good zinto? Is it a good thing? So Okay. And you ask to something on When I in. Recycling recycling that is being produced. More Africa population is not good at recycling. When the study got 2016, it was only 3.3%. Then it's about to be more recycling. When the urban land to the back of the seventy some half, enjoy a look at the population here, Rona. The lack of recycling here, it was about to as consumers, we don't want to let it into the long run. The seventy some half. A recycling shop shop key initiative at the link community eating. Recycling shop shops here, a of to the body clock and the tonal dijo, the apparel, but any other small luxuries, the tonal toys, depending on getting into anything available at the time. Lalo Rutata Hulu to our hand the recycling shops of the Quadilin, Luhukai, who to add it at the United States of America, for the 1960s, and then the Babita Horki a free store. The store still here, King Batwell or Bafanaka stock as a tonal dijo. Distributed drugs, lintu tama hala na kongo heba na lufana kachelete free music, lili concerts, malengo rote perform works of political art. 
Ubayas no msiya na nem. Pero ukti inta bayo kusay klisha. Inta la elu la kakuul yo kusay lun klabet. Hmm. Benga zaka kuul. Futa ni inta nyazi. Uti ama recycling service providers wana ge aba require ama members of the public to actually categorize their recyclables, which makes it easier to recycle. Uh huh. Can I tell you guys that you guys think on our social media pages? So we are working. Can challenge you guys to see the on your screen? This is indeed teenagers on a mission. Better to see ya, no boo. Absolutely right, I'm Zanti. I'm Tanji. We're talking all things recycling and the importance of it. Now, see us by future. Actually, song kela na inshaba ni. We all have a role. To play, so please, whatever waste that you produce, when the show is like that, we are recycling. Yep, oh yes, so I'm not here, guys. So I'm going to say, you get into a debate on recycling, as well as its importance. So, without further ado, let's see. Hey yo, what's going on? It's your boy C A W D Y, pronounced Cat. Yet again, running the streets of Johannesburg on another mission. Today we're all about recycling swap shops. You don't know what's that? Well, so thank you for way to us to about that. Without wasting any time, it's you and me in this mission. Let's go get them. Hello. Hi. Okay. Good thing. Good thing. Good thing. Good thing. Today, Yes. So, okay. um, so tell us who are you? Where are you from? And where are we? Okay. Um, Kinna Shalati Tefu. Um, I run a center called Imponya Natala Bing. Mm -hmm. We are based in Olivenhold Bosch Centurion. Yeah. Um, we have a few programs such as a children's home, an ECD center, um, three skills development programs, a community garden, and a children's church. Mm. So, Uti, you Yes. When was this and how long has it been? So, um, she founded the center in 2000. Yeah. We started off with the preschool. And as the community grew, when they were starting to build um, RDP houses, mm. there were a lot of social ills that arise. Yeah. So she then saw it fit to, you know, open doors for a place of safety. Mm -hmm. um, but as you know, place of safety, you can only take care of the kids to a certain um, period. Mm. And after that, they have to obviously go back home. Yeah. But as a result, they then stayed with us for years and we had to find ways in which we can generate income to look after them. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we do have a few income generating initiatives um, and so in our ECD center it's not a profitable business like you your normal preschools mm -hmm. and so um, you know as we start the programs other programs develop depending on the need mm -hmm. and I think the main one which we're going to be focusing on today is the skills development program yes, yeah. Yeah. but we thought okay how do we give them but then they must also learn something mm -hmm. so Oliver and Bosch has a waste management crisis so we thought, let's teach the youth how to collect recyclable items and use them for upcycling. Mm. An added benefit of incentivizing recycling is the community initiatives community legal and innovative ways a sense of pride the community ever do learn we all so this is the center here yes it is yes. okay where mainly is the upcycling project all right so we're going to start this side okay. this is alex alex is our painter guy <laughs> sharp, sharp. so i think it's only fair for him to give an introduction as to what he does and where he collects um the the items to create the paintings as well yeah okay. yeah so this is your workspace. So this is where your love is, your passion is. Yeah. So I, I I'm like it because I got a talent. Yeah. So I, I'm looking after myself, everything. So mm. I met Mama Asi from Timbonya yeah. yeah. I was selling these pictures mm. uh, by the robots there. Mm. He said, ah, guy, we are doing nice things. Eh? So you say recycled material learning. Yeah, they wanna learn it. Eh? Mm. I want this this first picture. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, seven canvas okay. like ama you see canvas like clothes you yeah. see that oh. this is not yeah it's not nice this one yeah. but because i'm just collecting them showing yeah. that uh, whatever you do you understand yeah. yeah let's talk about the importance of recycling and putting all these kids together and teaching them skills that they could have they couldn't learn anywhere 
ka mo di township ne a ke re batho ba tsa mae ga go ene ba la thadilo mo fatse so they don't understand gore in trail e build a waste yeah. and high build a waste it's a pollution high it's a pollution bana ba kula ke la bona so we thought it's best khuruta bana from preschool yeah. age gore ba understand gore you can walk past you know two liter bottle you yes. can actually use it yes. you can walk past paper because yes. little tala ko kai if go tletse magunwane le dilo tse 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 ngata tse so you know for us it was a, a, a concern gore re tlo ba ruta jwang but also re ba fe something you yeah. know and in fungas good laban tona la bo sebenza na bo ba tshola go bisa mo tsam because we are shoguti some in high school as school in manje abanye are they from the community abanye are they from the home so gona le ba ba tle stenke di social worker um gona le ba ba tle stenke maponesa so for example tatola they committed a crime and it's sort of like a community service thing um program that they do some of them are ordinary kids back in ko skolong and after school they really don't have much to do so they want to come and learn stuff some especially the primary school kids the parents are at work so there is no other place where they can you know sit and wait for their parents to get back from work wow i just saw some amazing arts yo yo alex is dope yo 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 okay so ngjele ke le material le uthola ku so um gona le ditam sites i get my community for example gona le like a double bed if somebody dumps something he actually strips it and he creates canvases from it because the canvas dia dura ke la bona ndona because we are self funded center le bona they must think out of the box okay so he's really really cool and that he finds stuff that we think we can throw away and he says no i can actually can use this use Okay so this is the candle section. So anyone who actually comes and volunteers we always try and have them make their own candles and take home and the nice ones we do sell. Okay so is everything here recyclable? Not everything, just some stuff. For example, if we get these are stuff that people throw away, yeah. you know, and we also use them um for the recycle for this project. You find that people are moving and they just dump stuff when we go and we look for them. Um and these are things that, you know, Brian makes you know good use of so the wax um the material to make the wax we buy um because it has to be good quality material yeah. um but the other stuff like strings and stuff we can yeah. find anywhere you know people really throw away stuff from hardware stores etc yeah. you can't have an excuse to say you don't have stuff to work with yeah. there are that stuff yeah. you know people yeah. throw away stuff all the time yeah. um and i think it's also lack of knowledge people don't know that they can actually use Mm. you know old uh, products and turn them into new products yeah. so this over here let me come this way yeah is the cutest project only because you know everyone gets involved meaning the preschool kids as well so they collect um the 2 liter bottles um we try and teach them how to make their own vertical gardens um we also use these 2 liter bottles for the community garden Recycling shop shop e bapala e huge role mo maphelong a batho ba ile gore ba sutlele mo Africa borwa. In particular gona o e bona ntse o yetsa hala ko Oliver Hotwash. Batho ba bangata he ba sebedisa di recycling shop shop gore ba tlo gona o fumana ntshotse ba di hlokang mpa ba sa gone ho direka ho bana ha bana challenge. Hello you are actively participating kapara a recycling shop shop incentive o ka gona o benefit directly or indirectly. This is our second hand clothing. So basically what happens here is that people who donate clothing to us. Yeah. Um this is through friends and obviously volunteers that come to the center. We don't just like to give kids clothes, you know. We try and have them do something in return. Yeah. So they also collect recyclable items and then they can pick what clothing they want. You know, in that way they don't obviously have that culture of receiving all the time. Yes. Yes. They are also doing something constructive which is, you know, keeping the environment clean. This is incredible. Thank you. Sure. Now young mama akhulu ba fetse ukubona amaqhwa asemzansi bethatha i recycling so seriously futhi beyisa kwelinye iziga. Nyana sile siya. Tembe ukuthi nonwa bileke emakhaya with this amazing amazing topic of recycling. Ingalibeleke keep those comments coming and we will see you after the break.
Yes, Mzanti, we are back. You are still watching the biggest show in the land when it comes to side take entertainment. Lena Sibi is on T O M Z. Monana S A B C One Mzanti for sure. With of course myself, your boy C A G, and the beautiful Bundi Wabandwana. Hi hi. In Kwa Yezi Mzanti Ke is about recycling, a topic we've actually visited before. So without further ado, get Maswele Nkumtu Walapa in South Africa. Was born in Mangalis. So this is home, mm -hmm. um, where the community food garden is. Okay. So mom basically teaches the water-wise farming system. Hello, mama. How are you? I'm okay. And how are you? I'm good. Good. So we're going to check this out today. Okay. So we're going to check So mama, what's going on here? What's going on here? What's going on here? Yeah. What we are doing here is uh, doing what we call water-wise gardening mm -hmm. because we are. Uh, staying in a very hot area now, yeah. we have decided to do this water-wise gardening, yes. which is to dig trenches uh -huh. and to insert two liter bottles into the ground yeah. so that the plants can receive underground irrigation. Wow. That's right. Okay, so in the recycling, the plants are working on the ground. So what we do, all the, 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 the waste from the, the kitchen and the waste from the garden yeah. is not now utilized to fertilize the soil mm. in the garden. Yeah. So we don't throw away anything that is uh, uh, degradable. Yeah. We use it to so fertilize it. So in the what kind of things do you use here? Uh, we use newspapers, yeah. which is, uh, the ink is said to be good for the soil and the vegetables. Yes. We use uh, a green manure, which is now the waste from the garden. Yes. We also use uh, dry twigs, uh, to create erosion mm. in the soil, mm. and then we use dry grass. The dry grass and, and twigs are fall under the category of grey manure. Yes. The green manure is the green stuff. Wow, recycling plants as well, incredible. So, is in Dennis Jalala, what kind of plants do you guys plant here? We plant uh, chomolia, mm -hmm. which is a popular plant in our community. Mm -hmm. We also plant spinach, mm -hmm. uh, onions, tomatoes, sweet potatoes. Yeah, and other, uh, like peppers as well, they do very well here. Yo, Mama, thank you so much for bringing us to your garden. I've learned so much. Yabonga, thank you so much. Bye-bye. You're most welcome. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much for inviting us to your space and teaching us more what you do. No, Kalebocha, really. You know, just to have your team come and, you know, visit communities and see what young people are doing is encouraging for us. Um, you know, it motivates us to do more. Thank you so much for inviting thank us. Bye-bye. Cheers. <laughs> Guys, Nisbon El and Feto, if we need to see and if we need don't sit down, Dwana Pusha. Invite everybody to help you if you have an idea. Push it, Dwana. Make sure it comes true. We've got you 100%. Otherwise, this is what we call mission accomplished, Dwana. Don't forget to recycle. Your boy C A W D Y pronounced Caddy. Is that again? Yes, Nako Ipipile, for us to put your knowledge to the test with the TOMZ quiz challenge. Do you remember Mzansi? You can also play along. Queen Kunda is a Pumana on Facebook and on Twitter. I mean, I'm going to be a little bit. So, I'm going to be a little bit. So, I'm going to be a little bit. No matter what, so please do the right thing. Do the best, and we shall do the rest. That being said, I'm going to be a little bit. You see, Puskola says, Valashelayo, and who will reign supreme in our TOMZ quiz challenge? Let's play. And that is why in today's episode, we're going to talk about secondary school. We're going to talk about the secondary school. We're going to talk about the secondary school. We're going to talk about the secondary science and technology. Lights, camera, and action. Are you ready to experience the ultimate edutainment? We're going to talk about the grade 10 learners. We're going to talk about the game team. We're going to talk about the game team. And we had loads and loads of fun. It's cool to be smart, guys, and don't let anyone tell you otherwise. And with TOMZ by your side, learning becomes fun. Into an arbitrary edutainment. Rabo fali di bukate makata that will empower the learners and keep them motivated. Di bukate di chobatu saka career guidance. Obani kina ko etsanzim bana hane kabuka musoba bone. We wouldn't be TOMZ can't tell or rebel at the dance of challenge. We want to return to hearts and roots and not to mono mo TOMZ. All right, take a photo of Mbuzo when you call out Ohamba Ganji. Nila Lili Sisa, ne? We tested their knowledge with the TOMZ because we saw Team A winning the first round. 
A for making it through to the knockout challenge. Got three right to the second round. Morilin Rabona, great 10 learner over Mita Murki. Sibusi so Dabini knocking everyone out. Rato Tibabla, the speed round master. Bonga, the Sposis of Damini for Ugu Mangoba went on Amshanjo. Got to a people Sibis Mangobong and Bellamel Mobi and Pitney. Then I gave a few to Sibis and a Tom speed round master. We are in things where the manger ends of Nigel and Dolina. We could not own Tatel exactly the same pattern we beg when in Dow. And we found it in Kulu, Piers Gwenani. Over me, is a sodra, forty nooms of Pella MB, ne? Oh, no, two minutes, two minutes, Wako Okala, right about Jenga Manjasam. All right, we're fit. Hello, Luna, but let's check a little school. So, all you have to do is email TOMZ at sabc.co.za. Who's about man? You never go check a local school on Sahel. Three, two, one, and your time is up. All right, you guys, Songa says, Bam Shaba, what you need is just gentle, loving care. And recycling is part of that. So, as one again, the future when it comes to recycling. Despite the increased production of plastic, it's only 14% that thing hasn't been recycling. However, Ntoya Uitlo Chenta Hobani Generation Naruna Eta Recycling Technology and Ngata Elo Ngoro Kurtusa who recycle plastic mona here na Ibele Rizkaya La Selaka Mo Haradi Landfills How do you mean it's a clock? Clock yana ki a recycling robot Elo Ngoro Inali di Twin Suction Cups Ibele Inali Masho a robot Ibele Sebele Sa Artificial Intelligence who rito kono hu fumana di plastic tenga ta Elo Ngoro Tori fumana from a conveyor belt Ibele Sebele Sa for recycling Tokyana has revolutionized the plastic industry. Mulfatin Larna Kaufele. Okono Fumana, the plastic items from a conveyor belt, it will incate 60 per minute, which is 20 more than the average human worker. All right, but this is Sigler to the end of Inkobe and I'm Sanjay. Temuji no Nobeka Kulu, because I know myself and Sia did just that. And now you know that every day is a recycling day in order to keep our planet Earth safe. Now it's good to get a conversation here to Aiteli Apa on Facebook, we are simply Tom and on Twitter, we are Tom's underscore SABC underscore one. Mm, and for more info on the show and to keep tabs on the show, we to have our show wa 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 dot education dot four dot za forward slash T-O-M-Z. Otherwise, if you can't get enough of all of this, you can simply visit my Twitter account at LMCA underscore G. And I'm Bunda underscore P on Instagram. Happy recycling, Bando Bye. So, we have a little bit of 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 a